ever seen in the UFC. And if you don't find the striking range early against this guy, you could be in real trouble. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem Abdul-Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you could do that, you could do anything. I fear not the official Ladies introduction. Here is this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Bergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the O2 Arena in London, England. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 165 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Assassin! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner! This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon! Lee! All right, get the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times, and a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners, my fight. gets underway and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist, but on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true 5 2 player. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. His misses are not Plus right hand is true. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. Oh, that's a nice strike. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Lee gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Just unable to quite find that range. Check the high kick. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Good punch. 
Nice body kick. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? He blocks the punch. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Leg kick. Oh, good job defensively to block the strike there by Lee. It's such a fast leg kick. Beautiful. Just misses with the straight right. Blocks the shot. Oh, beautiful job here defensively. And then he lands the counter shot. So he's really starting to get the timing of his opponent and working this fight right into his wheelhouse as the consummate counter striker. Back to the well with that right hand. It's no good. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Right hook to the head blocked. And he landed the right hand there. Thirty seconds now to go in round one. Well, it's not always easy being a counter striker, but when you can execute the style this effectively, it really is something to behold. You'll see he'll try to draw the opponent in here yet again, and as soon as his opponent strikes, he'll try to use that wayward offense against him and get back to his countering game that really has been the big story in this one thus far. Punch to the body is blocked. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC. And I'd imagine a lot of these replays are going to be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're going to see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Kick is blocked. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Beautiful body kick. He's still in this. I mean, he's cutting them down to the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Oh, slips to avoid the right. Mess 
massive head kick. Oh, oh big nice knee there. Oh, big left. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. There's no give on that leg kick. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Well, his opponent found an opening there to the body. Nice hook shot there, but as he leans forward in trying to get into his own striking range, he's gonna pay the price there to the body. Gotta be careful. You don't wanna eat too many of those power hooks downstairs. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Oh, big punch lands. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Oh, that's a beautiful kick right there. I don't know if you've ever been kicked by a mule. Probably feels something like that. It has to. This guy is landing his kick with so much force. The issue with that kick, as effective as it is, one gets checked, you have the Anderson Silva situation. Nice head kick. Well, nice job there to use his opponent's offense against him as he lands the counter hook. Nice strike there by Lee. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes. He continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Look at him chop the wood. Chop the wood with this leg kick. All right, that horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going here. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Oh, man, I'm, I'm just so glad that front kick didn't hit me. It kind of felt like it did. Right in the sternum. Your opponent come forward, you drive the ball of your foot into your opponent's sternum and hope to really affect the breathing. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. 
It was a good night if that landed. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Oh, head kick. Knee to the body. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here, really starting to connect on a lot of strikes to the midsection here in the latter stages of this fight. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, beautiful head movement. Slips there. Oh, nice slip there. Great head movement overall by this guy defensively tonight. He does a great job of moving his head side to side and really mixing up the motion at which he moves. Lee gets caught with that punch. Gotta shore up the defense here. Punch coming, it's blocked. All right, let's go. Let's get those hands going now. Give it up. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Nice counter shot there. Oh, big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Back to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Shot is blocked there by Lee. Big shot lands. Oh man, that left side is getting beat up now. Look at the redness there. Nice kick there by Lee. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Head off the center line, slips the punch. Lee's kick, that one blocked. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. Right, lands a kick there, pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Just out of range with that strike. 15 seconds remain in the round. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Gotta be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Combination lands for him. He is really putting his strikes together tonight. I mean, he's feeling himself tonight, John. He's doing a great job of putting everything together. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC, and if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Bone on bone as the head kick lands flush. He better get those hands up or he's gonna put him to sleep.
Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bears watching. That's going to hurt this opponent. Oh, man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard. He kicks so hard every time you can see him drive his shin into his opponent. Well, he's got to be on top of the world, dominating this fight. The stamina still on point. He didn't skip those Versa Climber days, that's for sure. No, this has to feel good. This has to feel like everything we did in training camp has worked to perfection. Look for him to try to replicate that before his next fight. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Head kick attempt. It's blocked. Nice leg kick. He loaded up there on that high kick. Two minutes now to go. There, the hook shot is blocked by Lee. Oh, what a punch! You don't know when that leg keeps coming. Big and kick. There's no tell on that leg kick. Throwing that jab, no good. Beautiful strike. Under a minute to go. Spinning back fist. Didn't see that one coming. Grab that head, or he's going to get blasted. All the ground and pound strikes continue to rain down. The opponent better move out of harm's way, or the referee's going to stop this. He better start to move, and when his opponent starts to posture, he needs to put his feet on the hip, push him away, to try to escape this very, very dangerous position. Nice job defensively there to get the guard up. Shot is blocked by Lee. Good job, guys. All right, so there is the horn at times in that previous round. I didn't think we'd get here after that head kick nearly had him out of there. It was a good round leading up to that. But when you take a head kick like that, when your opponent gets your entire body into that kick, usually the night's over. Very tough to still be standing, but he can't take many more like that.
All right, next round is now underway. DC, any major takeaways after the previous five minutes? That both of these guys are very evenly matched. The matchmakers did a fantastic job when they put these two in the octagon. So even though it wasn't crazy, you got to see high-level mixed martial arts. Able to check that kick as well. Great punch. Oh, Superman punch is good. You can tell he's been working on that. And a miss with the right hook. That shot blocked by Lee. Just missed with the left there. Oh, big left hand there. Good stick. And that left hook landed on the button. Checks the leg kick. Nice body shot. Big punch lands through the middle. Way to hide that leg kick. And he switches his stance yet again. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. All right, it's late in the fight now. I don't need to be a judge to tell you that he is clearly losing. What is a fighter's mentality when you know you need a finish or you're getting an L? This is when you got to go to the Nate Diaz mentality kill or be killed. You got to throw everything at your opponent because if this thing goes to the judges, you are not going to win this fight. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Real quick leg kick. Oh, hook shot blocked there by Lee. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Trying to establish that jab once again. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Big kick lands. got to check these low leg kicks. Just misses with the jab there. Under two minutes remain in the fight. Big punch land. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Outstanding kick there by Lee. Liver kick. Hook shot attempt to the head here. Instead, it's blocked by Lee. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. Caught the kick. Fight's gonna be over DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent, thought he was going low. And now he's got to hurt very badly. Just missed on that spinning attack. Blocks the shot. Kick that at least partially landed. Oh my goodness, he got kicked in the head and he's still standing. Whiffs on the right hand. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. 
All right, so a good job defensively by him here as he raises the guard and prevents any damage. Shades of James Tony, always seeing things coming at him. He's such a great defensive fighter. What a fight! All right, let's look back at some of the action, DC. They go the distance tonight, but you gotta think he won over the judges with his striking acumen tonight. Yeah, you got to watch one of the best strikers in the entire UFC. He did everything so well, and in my opinion, he should cruise to a very easy decision. The official decision is in. It resides with Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 50-45. Playing the winner by unanimous decision, 